Just before I go into this month's updates for the Fretboard Atlas, I want to let you know that there are over 400 video lessons on the channel now. And I want to say a personal thank you to everyone who has subscribed to the channel, watched the videos, learned from the videos, left positive comments and given me feedback on them. I really appreciate it. I really enjoy doing this and I hope we can keep doing it for a long time to come. Here's what's happening this month on the Fretboard Atlas. So we've already gotten a head start on June 2021 by covering the musical modes. Now, if you haven't covered the modes before, they might seem a little bit confusing at the start, but trust me, once you get your head around them, they are really, really useful. So I definitely recommend to dive into learning about the musical modes on the channel. In the All Things Guitar section in the past month, we've been looking at walking bass lines and strumming techniques for the guitar. This coming month, we're going to be looking at how to improve your picking hand accuracy and your fretting hand accuracy um, in order to make your playing cleaner and to make it more controlled. I think they're really, really crucial skills. In the traditional Irish music section, we're going to be learning a new tune in each of our subsections. So that means a new jig, a new reel, a new polka, a new hornpipe, a new slip jig, and a new slow air as well. This past month in the Shane's Original section, we looked at my tune Summer Anywhere, which is actually a collection of tunes from my album Idzerhjol, and I had told you that I would teach you Through the Woods, and I got mixed up and I taught my tune Jumbo instead. My mistake. So this month, we're actually going to look at Through the Woods, and we're also look, going to look at my tune Dance Tonight from my album Marrakesh. On the interview side of things this month, we're going to be hearing from an amazing Congolese guitar player named Nuel Tsumbu, whose music and style on the guitar I absolutely love. And also from Kieran Daniel, a guitarist and a producer from Melbourne in Australia, whose early solo guitar approach was a big influence on me. Remember, as I always say, I want to teach you what you want to learn. If there's a topic, a subject, a technique, a song, whatever it might be, I will teach you to the best of my ability, no matter what it is, and I'll do my best to simplify it down to its most uh, approachable form and show you how to use it in your own musical practice. So if all of that sounds good to you, grab your guitar and let's start learning. <laughs> 